All right, what's up? We're gonna unbox this Rode VideoMic Me for cell phones, forward, forward facing, back facing camera. Um, it's got a dead cat in there too for windy, windy occasions. This is in the box. Let's see, this shit pops off, that's nice. You don't have to uh, cut it with scissors. Here's the mic. It's got the dead cat on it already. And the dead cat slides off. So for indoor use or, you know, if it's not windy, um, you just use it like this. I have a Samsung Galaxy S7. So it just plugs in the mic port just like that. And then, here is this piece that actually holds it in place. So that slides on there, which is on pretty tight. And you just wedge it all the way until it holds the, holds the phone so then it won't rotate around. It kind of stays there so you can film, film yourself like that. Um, or you can turn this thing around and film others. And I'll do a little mic test here. Um, the dead cat just slides on there like that. That's probably really nice in the wind. Um, my stock camera app on the Galaxy S7, it recognized the mic and used it right away. Um, my game tools screen recording app for when you're gaming and you're recording your screen, it didn't recognize the mic, so I got a different, um, different app for that. I got DU Recorder, which did recognize this mic right away, and it sounds a lot better. Yeah, so that's everything that's in the box. You have the mic, you have the little rubber rubber clip that holds it onto your phone or whatever device, and you have the windscreen or dead cat. That's pretty much it. You have your manual instructions. Pretty straightforward, doesn't need batteries or anything. Now you can see this is forward-facing camera, Samsung Galaxy S7. This is just with the stock microphone and it's probably, I don't know, probably two feet away from my face. I'm in a sunroom so it's kind of a closed room and now I'll put on the mic. Or right when I plugged the Rode video mic into the phone it said recording with um, headphone mic on the Samsung Galaxy just standard recording app. So now this is with the Rode video mic me in Samsung Galaxy S7 with the forward-facing camera. Um, just inside, it's quiet in here, but it's a little bit echoey because there's it's a sunroom. Okay, now I'm filming with the rear-facing camera. I'm holding the phone still about three feet away from me on a selfie stick. And this is with the internal microphone of the Samsung Galaxy S7. So now I'm gonna film like this, as if I'm filming someone else with the forward or the rear facing camera and the mic facing that way. But then I'm also gonna talk into here so you can hear how much audio you get from behind. So I just plugged in the Rode VideoMic Me. I have the Rode VideoMic Me facing away from me. Like that. I have it facing away from me so if I was to be filming someone talking to the camera, it's about three feet away from me and this is the audio you'll get from behind the mic. I am in a small or in a sunroom with it's a little bit echoey in here mostly windows now I will turn the mic around and face it towards me and continue to film forward now I'm filming forward on the rear rear camera of the Samsung Galaxy S7 with the mic pointed towards me right, now I am skateboarding outside with the Samsung Galaxy S7 internal mic. Um, it's not windy out here, but we are moving around a little bit. There's some wind. That's just with the internal mic. Video mic can be installed. And there's no windscreen on it. This is just the video mic me. Um, without the windscreen, here's the windscreen. Cruising around a little bit. It's not
Right. Now the windscreen is on. Road video Mike me. Cruising around. A little bit of wind coming this way. I'm um, not sure if you can hear it on the other one, but front facing camera. I'm just going to blow into the mic. That's me blowing into the mic. Here's with the video mic pro. All right, recording with the earphone mic. Just read that to me, so now I'm recording video mic pro. Video mic me, me, now I'll blow into this. I think the video mic me picks up a lot more wind noise than just the internal mic because it's a lot bigger surface area to actually grab wind noise. So it's more susceptible to wind noise. So you need you need to wear the or put the windscreen on um, when you're filming with the video mic me. That's blowing it with the dead cat on there. I bet it's a whole lot better. When I'm filming myself like this, I notice the this mic sounding a lot better than the stock mic. When you're filming for games, you're screen sharing your phone or you're holding your phone about this close and you're filming yourself, I think the video mic me is where it probably shines the most as opposed to, here's the internal mic, I'll flip Now it's the internal mic and I'm filming myself. I'm in a very quiet room though. Um, I've noticed when I've used this mic, when I've been um, recording Clash of Clans and games, the mic sounds way, my voice sounds way better on the mic than in a, a room with noise, even without background noise. It sounds, uh, sounds a lot better to me. This is a quiet room though, so it might be pretty similar. So that's kind of my uh, review on the video mic me. Um, I did record my whole Florida surfing vlog um, with Samsung Galaxy S7 before I had the mic. And quite a bit of the audio, not quite a bit, but the audio didn't sound great. And some of it was totally unusable. I think with this, I would have been able to record it and it would have been all good audio. I'll put the link in the description for the mic and the S7 if you want to pick it up. Um, yeah, pick it up through my link. That helps support the channel. Thanks a lot, guys. Like and subscribe. Peace out.